Okay, we've got enough time. We can do this. I need something glossy on. I just can't. I can't. I can't. I always need a gloss. Always need a gloss. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I am giving you guys a <laughs> well, not really. So if you hear Gooby in the background, it's because David's taking a shower and I'm in here and she's not allowed in here and she's not allowed in the bathroom because she likes to wreck the toilet paper. It's a thing. Cat life. So if you hear her meowing, just please ignore it. Just please, please try the best. Try your best. It's not animal abuse. I just don't want her fucking in here. Anyways, today I am doing something I haven't done since I was a sophomore in high school, believe it or not, which is Frenching my hair. Now, <laughs> if you, I don't even know, like at least this was a thing when I was in high school. There was a lot of girls that come to school. Actually, eighth grade. It started for me in eighth grade because I noticed some girls that were doing it and I could never figure out how. I could never figure out how these girls got their hair so fucking curly and then one day I figured out oh it's with hair gel and was one of those girls that was scrunched my hair oh gosh yeah it was a thing it was a thing and I did love to do it at the time the hairstyle and like it was scrunched and held with gel so I didn't have to worry about it but at the same time it was a wreck and it was really hard to wash out of my hair and I always tend to get cat balls as my mom likes to call them in the back of my head when she used to brush my hair just like big matted mess of a hairball in the back of my head. So that would happen when I scrunch my hair. Today, we are going back to 16 year old Sam, like sophomore in high school. I thought I was so cool. And we're going to scrunch our hair for the first time since then. And I'm kind of nervous about it. I did end up buying this gel. But this video in mind, to be honest, I bought this from Rennie's. I think it was like $4 or something. The Rock Your Hair Annie Rocks Cheer Dance and Gymnastics Gel, which means it's gonna be very strong, hold really well, hopefully. Smells weird, so I'm a little nervous about it. When I used to scrunch my hair, Alba, if you're watching this, you can attest, we used to use these big tubs of gel and they were all different colors and I thought they were so pretty and I remember she got me the pink one for my birthday and I had a blue one and I was just obsessed, obsessed, obsessed. And that was the gel that I would use in the giant tubs from like Walmart. I'm not sure if they still sell them. That's the kind of gel that we would use. Thing, or I'd get the LA Looks gel in a bottle. If I can find a picture, I'll throw it right here. These are the kind of gels that we used to use. Nonetheless, it was an easy hairstyle and it looked good and I didn't have to mess with it. And also, any, anyone else remember doing the little Snooky, the mini Snooky bun, mini Snooky poof right in the front of your head? Yeah, yeah, I used to do that too. A lot of you, I think there's probably a couple videos on here of me with that hairstyle still. So there's that. Jump right in because I keep just babbling. So right now my hair is extremely grown out as you guys can see and I am going to be making a hair appointment actually with my hair guy to do my hair because you guys can see my highlights need to come down a little bit. The reason why my hair has been growing so long I have to attest I can't even say if it's really sponsored but it is kind of sponsored because your girl got a sponsor by Heartbreaker Gummies which are so freaking amazing holy crap you guys know i love hair skin and nail gummies they're some of my favorites especially when i had short hair they really helped me to grow my hair back out when it was really short really been helping me honestly to keep my hair really healthy and also to try and bring my nails back to life since most of you guys know i had gel nails on for a few months and i really damaged my nails and acrylics and all that kind of stuff just really really wears and tears at your nails and also my skin because my skin has been kind of all over the place last month since i switched jobs and stress and huge shout out and thank you to heartbreaker gummies for sending these over. I have been testing them out. As you guys can see, the bottle is half empty. I just forgot to take them yesterday. I really love these a lot. They are so cute. First of all, the packaging is so cute and adorable. Like, I'm absolutely obsessed. And I love their tagline. It says, make them boys cry, which I think is so cute. And it's also hollow. I showed on my Instagram story. You guys can see right there. It's hollow. So cute. And not only that, but they are shaped. They are shaped little heart. You guys can see like their little hearts and they're so cute. All you do is take two a day, just like any other hair skin nail gummy. You guys know I've loved ones in the past and I was really excited when they reached out to me because this is something that I really, really love to try and use. And they are also soy free, cruelty free, and gluten free. So if you guys would like to get your hands on some of these, you can use my code MYGLOWING for 20% off on all orders on the site. I will have everything linked down below. This is a one month supply. You can get a one month, two month, I think up to three month. I will have notes right here if I'm wrong on any of that and all down below. Back to the video. So now we are going to, I'm gonna show you guys how I would scrunch my hair. Really fucking dreading this as we speak. I would just take some gel in my hand. Ooh, it's pink pretty so I would take some gel I would usually take more than this but it's gl fuck it's guys it's fucking glittery 
All right, well, we're gonna have glittery ass hair today. Wow, it's really glittery. I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see the glitter in there. Wow, okay. And I would just run it through my hair, so I'm just gonna actually flip my hair over because I cannot picture myself doing that. Doing it that way, no. I'm just gonna put some, oh my God, <laughs> I'm getting flashbacks. And I would just get it all through my hair. But in high school, I would like throw it all through the roots of my hair, like really get it in there, that sort of thing. But since I'm not in high school anymore, I don't want to do it that way. Make sure I get it in all parts of my hair. Okay, cool. And if I feel like I need more, like I'll go back and get a little bit more. So I'll just put a little bit. I can't believe this shit is glittery. And make sure it's like all straightened out. All right. So then next after I do this, I would start scrunching my hair. But since there's a lot of big chunks in there, I'm just going to shake it really quick. Okay. And then I would just start going like this to scrunch your hair. It's pretty simple. Everyone always like gave me compliments like, oh my god, Sam, your hair looks so good when it's scrunched like that. Oh my god. And thankfully, I'm washing my hair tomorrow, so big of a deal. But I feel like this gel is not the best to use. I don't know. I feel like it's already dried. It's very sticky, too. So if you're a dance mom or you're a girl that does dance or you're, you know, whatever, this gel will hold in place. And it's sparkly, but luckily I don't really see much sparkle in it. I don't know. Then I'll just keep scrunching it and scrunch. Looks decent. But this is how I would do it. I remember the first time I actually did this to my hair in eighth grade because I had like a packet of gel, like a sample. And I was like, oh my God, I'm going to have gel, like I have crimped hair and it's going to look so cute. Split up some of these bigger pieces. And then I go to school. Then I went to school and it all like fell out. And I was like, okay, well, I'm not that bitch today. Oh my God. Oh my God. It definitely doesn't look as it did in high school. This kind of reminds me of my co-teacher because she has naturally really curly wavy hair. Or my old, co yeah, my, wow, can't talk ever. This reminds me kind of my old co-teacher because she has really naturally curly wavy hair and she puts mousse in it when it's wet and then it gets really curly like this and it looks so nice that's a no i have to stand up i'm sorry guys because i have to see better what i'm doing yeah so this is basically <laughs> oh my god i can't believe i've done this ah oh, fuck I can't believe I've done this. But I definitely remember my hair being a lot more like scrunchy up here. It's probably the way that I applied the gel because I really didn't want a shit ton of it on my roots, even though it's what I used to do because believe it or not, guys, I gotta go out and do errands today. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so crazy. Wow, hello. And you guys know I like to flip my hair to one side. So we're gonna just, oh my God. Oh my God. Usually I'll add more gel to it, but I feel like this is, this is, this is, this is fine for today. This is fine. But you know what? I actually don't mind it. I think it would be a lot better. And I don't know if, I don't know, let me know down below did, if you guys used to do this hairstyle. Did you used to have your hair wet first and then do it? Sometimes I would do it that way. Sometimes I did it dry like this. This hair, this gel holds, like it's dry already. So maybe if you're gonna do this, don't use this gel, but I, I don't think it looks that bad. I think I might just like put a hair clip in and just like put the side over and put it up a little bit. Very like jelly and crusted. <laughs> is very crusty. The more crusty the gel and the hard, the better. Hmm, can never talk. So this is basically how basic how I would scrunch my hair. Obviously, I'm 26 now and I don't do this on a regular basis, but like this used to be like my thing. But of course, the underneath the hairs were still, yeah, this is exactly how it would be because underneath it would still be like not scrunched. And I was like, as long as the top part looks scrunched, it's all that matters. So I'm gonna go out public like this today. So <laughs> hope you guys enjoyed this video and you got a laugh out of it. If I do this again, it's gonna be for my when my hair is wet. Shout out to my old co-teacher because I'll do the same hairstyle she has. We're just gonna retire this and maybe donate it to a little girl that does gymnastics because not for me. With that being said, I love you guys so much. Hope you have an awesome day. Subscribe if you want to see more of me. Like this video if you enjoyed. Turn on bell post notifications so you know when I post a new video. Again, if you guys want to get Heartbreaker gummies, use, you can use my code, Mike Glowing, for 20% off all your orders. They are really good. They taste great. They're really good. They taste great. They taste just like strawberries. I didn't even get to mention that. I'm so awful. I'm so sorry. I love you guys. <laughs> but I love you guys. See you in my next one.